Hey, we're checking out the only game where transporting cars is the number one cause of insanity. It's GTA. We want to find out which GTA vehicle could transport cars under the most rigorous conditions. So the duo of Petey and Alex have put together a new ridiculous board that they call a sanity check for any truck driver. You have to go through a growing amount of ridiculous traps and in the end you have to be able to transport a car without losing it or you can't complete the board. Let's do this. Now Petey and Alex have given me a large number of vehicles that can tow cars and I decided I would pick the one that looks like it would drive me insane the quickest. I figure if I'm insane immediately, then maybe I won't feel the agony from the rest of the board. Now in the beginning here, you can see we have very simple speed bumps, I would call them. It's funny when simple speed bumps are about six foot tall. Now the big issue is in the end, I can't just get a car in the back and then drag it through the course. The, the vehicle has to be functional apparently in order for me to be able to beat this board. And I can see that somewhere in the distance, there is a sideways wall of death. I don't even know what that is. It's just like he made part of the board sideways, whatever. So down the final one of those, now we're gonna go up the Titanic ski hill of depression and not gonna make it. <laughs> now I do have hydraulics to help me, but the hydraulics are not going to save me here if I don't have the horsepower to get this thing up the hill. The John Deere couldn't even make it past the second challenge on the entire board. That means there's only one answer. The penalty is death. Oh yeah. We're going for something with a bigger engine. Now you may say to yourself, great, how do you get the pintos in the back of the truck? Well, the most obvious way. I just drive them at full speed and run into it. <laughs> I actually had to back this thing in because they won't stay in the truck otherwise. Okay, I found the key. The key is I had to drive the Pinto in the- Oh my god. So the big challenge is going to be actually getting the Pinto to the end. This truck has such power, but the very first time I try and take any one of these bumps, the Pinto goes launching out of the back. There we go. Okay, as long as I'm somewhat controlled in how I go over these bumps, it looks like I can keep the Pinto. Oh yeah, it's nice and snug in there. Look at it. The truck is hugging it lovingly, like a parent, okay? But just like a parent, it'll probably end up kicking the Pinto out of the house just as soon as it graduates high school. <laughs> okay, so before, the John Deere couldn't even make it up this hill. I don't think we're gonna have any problem now. Oh yeah, okay. So I didn't even use all- Oh my god. I didn't even use all of my speed, and we made it right up. Oh, there's not really a hill here. It's just a sheer wall. Oh, God. Oh! That went a lot better than I thought it would. Okay, so now I have to... <laughs> oh, God. What is that in the distance? There's a bunch of windmills. <laughs> of course there is. Okay, so I just have to wall ride this. The problem is the Pinto isn't really in the back of the truck that well. It is just barely... Okay, the wall is not that slanted, so that's good. So not a big deal, go up the side, that's probably there so that all the 18 wheelers have a pro- Oh no, 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 stay on the road, stay on the road, no! ah! We die together. Everything's fine, no problem. Oh yes. Now if you're in the back and you're still inside of the vehicle that I'm towing, you probably think that you're experiencing death every 10 or 12 seconds. That's because you are. Now, I need to remember not to slam on the brakes. So what is with these speed bumps? Ugh, that's not that bad. So now it gets a little bit taller. Okay, now I might have to use my hydraulics here. Hold on, no, we're gonna, we're gonna pop this just a little bit. I don't want too much speed. Boop, there, perfect, no problem. Now we have just a, it's like a, it's like a vanishing speed bump. Now we have the spinning speed bump over here. Okay. Now we have slanted speed bumps. Great. Oh yeah. Oh, this is great. The good part is this truck has a decent, you know, like a, a decent, di uh, a decent distance between the frame and the wheels. I'm going to wait for this to go away and then go and then go over it. Pop over this. Another rolly one. Uh, no. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Now Pinto, don't go. Don't try and go out on your own. Oh, how do I get it back in the back of the truck? I just thought about that. I don't have a platform to get this thing in the back again. 
I have to start at the beginning. You know what? We're trying a new truck. Now, the idea here is that once I get the car inside the hauler, there should be almost no way for it to come off. I'm going for sheer quantity. If I have enough of these things, out of the way. <laughs> If I have enough of these things, one of them has to make it to the end, right? <laughs> I'm already gonna lose my first one. It is, it is valiantly trying to hang in there though. Oh God. <laughs> it is gonna be raining pintos on the townsfolk below. Oh, this is the worst idea I ever had. I didn't think this thing could get so much air. I'm sorry. I feel like this second time is gonna go a lot better than the first time. Except for the fact that one of the vehicles is now twitching violently inside of the back tailgate of the transporter. <laughs> I don't know what is going on. They shovel around back there and it causes really odd things to happen. And now my one car is, is being Borg absorbed into the transporter. Oh, yeah. The Whoa. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Ah. This has got to be the one to do it, right? I mean, it's got tons of power. It's got quite a, oh, it's got quite a bit of speed. The rear end started a Tokyo drip there without me. That's kind of bad. All right, so now with the hydro, jeez. With the hydraulics, I should be able to pop over all of these problems. I'm starting to learn as well what the handling on this thing is like. It's awful. <laughs> it's, it's terrible. But once I kind of understand it, I think I can keep this thing on the center of the track a lot better and not have it randomly catapult to, to its own death. <laughs> hey, hey, Alex, the Pintos don't need to be a- Oh my God, what is happening? <laughs> The windows don't need to be in good condition, do they? Like, this could be CarMax, you know, uh, uh, very fine condition style, right? My one Pinto is dancing like EDM style in the back. Look at it go. It is break dancing on the back of my car hauler. I don't understand what is occurring. Oh, God, I didn't think about this. Oh, the windmills. The windmills are so fast. This thing's so long. There's no way. Oh, wow. <laughs> Thing bounces incredibly. Okay, this is the best of both worlds. Now, see, the Pinto is nice and protected, okay, inside of the box, and this thing has power. So it kind of has a little bit of everything. I wish I could have shoved two in here, but I couldn't get them both to stay, <laughs> and they won't fit in sideways. Big question, can it make it up this hill? Oh, it can absolutely make it up the hill. Perfect. All right, do the sad little wall ride. The top speed on this is trash. It is absolute trash, so I do have to skid the front tires in order to complete the minor wall ride. Now, through all of the speed bumps of death. Oh yeah. Oh, this is probably the best one yet. This is easily the best one yet. Look at this. Yeah, you you can't you can't thrust me. That sounds terrible. You can't bounce upward really okay maybe you can you know what you just do whatever you want red angry fruit by the foot jeez All right now i just have to make it past this okay now windmills the problem is we're not really long but really slow that car is gonna land on its wheels totally stuck that landing all right maybe it was just me maybe oh god no no i'm testing something Yep, my test revealed that this hurts a lot. Okay, how about this one? Now I can fit multiple Pintos in there. I shoved three of them in the back. Maybe I could have fit a fourth. We'll never really know. The problem is that... <laughs> the problem is the ones on the top are just getting ejected at full speed. They're like little metal popcorns violently exploding in the back of this thing. We're doing good so far. So far, so good. It does have enough power. Again, top speed is a little lacking. Okay, when I said the top speed is lacking, the top speed is garbage. It is a lot worse than I thought it was. Oh my God, the center of gravity on this thing is terrible. Okay, check this out. This is car haulers, okay? Car transporters. What if we hook one to the tow ropes? Eh? Huh? Now it can't go anywhere. <laughs> oh, this poor car. I am so, oh my God, I just ran on top of it. <laughs> I am so sorry for what you are about to experience as we go through this board. Again, 
Hopefully it still functions if and when I manage to get to the end of this insanity. Because the more I look onward at what out- Oh god, I need to look at the where I'm going and not all the way in the front. The more I look at what's coming up, the more I realize just how bad things are going to get. Oh, the other thing is this is kind of long because it's on the tow ropes. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh my god. Oh, it is not fine. Things are absolutely the opposite of fine. They were so unfine that I almost fell to my death. Let's not go bungee jumping without the bungee today. God, I can't back this thing up because I'm getting stuck on this. God, it's like strawberry flavored pain. I know you're thinking to yourself, Great, how are you gonna fix this? What are you gonna do? Listen, I have a plan. All right, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna bounce this over. Now I'm gonna ram this thing off. And you say to yourself, Gray, are you really gonna sit there and slowly, like 100 times, ram this truck? Yep, sure am. You just gotta have the tenacity to succeed. See, right there, boom. I'm not making this same mistake twice. All right, Gray, use use the full power of the hydraulics. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh, things are going great. I mean, I say, I say great, things are, oh, why? I'm like a helicopter. Listen, it could work, okay? In case any of you were wondering, you can, well, okay. I was gonna say you can fit three Pintos on this thing. You can actually realistically fit two. I need to find something that's fast enough to make it past the windmills. Oh, we're gonna do it. We are gonna do it. We are not going to do it. I am going to die now. I am falling to my death right now at this moment. I am dead. I wanted to give it one more try. I thought, you know, maybe I did something wrong. Maybe this car is the magical car. Maybe Alex programmed it to be stronger, faster, better. He did not. He programmed it to kill me for a second time now. All right, now while I know this is another tow truck, this one's a lot faster. Oh, look at the speed. Look at the agility. And the car behind us is you know, driving really well. Like it's staying in line with the tow truck. This may be the number one best car hauler. Okay, over the sad fruit roll-ups. Very good. No problem. We're gonna have to use a little bit of hydraulics here, but it is okay. We are, woo, we are, oh my God. We are okay. Now, it's just a matter of, can it make it past the windmills? I hate green energy. Yes, final, no. Oh my God. Well, that went into another zip code. I don't care how many times it takes. I, uh, no joke, I've done this so many times. I'm slowly learning, oh, look at that. I'm slowly learning the pattern of all of the wind turbines, yes! What is this? Oh, you just go in the middle, right? I mean, man, you do not give me a lot of room for failure, do you? Okay, here's the plan. We're gonna pop this nice and smooth. Perfect. No, Pinto, don't do it. You just, you stay right there. I will come and save you. Do not move. Do not move. There we go. Now, just, just, get, no, connect to the tow truck. Don't, no, do not move closer to the death, what, to the death mills. Stop that. All right, here's the plan. I'm gonna, I'm gonna punch this thing forward. There we are. Use wind power, they said. It's safe, they said. Really? It, what is, what is this? Oh, it's like, uh, it's like, oh no! 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 How are you supposed to make that jump? I learned something very unusual about this area. So let me, let me not die. Let me show you something. Alex has put stop sticks on a rotation a circular rotation. So I have to time this, get through the stop sticks, dodge them, and then do the best jump I can. And then if I get enough speed, no! Oh, come on. It's fine, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I know how to get this. Oh my God, okay, good. I know how to get, if the, if the stop sticks touch the back car, does that count? Finally, yes! Oh, it, oh it's boosts. Oh, but do I need the boost? Do I want the boost? I don't know. Oh, I don't need the boost at all. Oh yeah. Oh, this is amazing. Now, do I want the boost? Oh, it's boost and stop sticks. Okay, so I need to time this so that I hit the boost probably. I don't want the stop sticks because I won't make that jump. 
Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, God. Oh, this is- Ah, no! Well, at least it doesn't kill me. It just makes it so I can't complete this yet. Maxima! Oh, I missed. Oh, wait, here we go. Maxima! Wow, that is a really big jump. This board is incredibly painful. Okay, that was also very painful. <laughs> oh, I kind of flipped the cop car with my body. Oh, that is exactly what this board is like. Oh yeah, I fit not one, but two Pintos in here. This is doing incredible, whoa. I say that right as my run almost ends. This thing is doing incredible so far. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Watch this. Speed, uh, agility, boom, past all the windmills, like it's nothing. Oh my god, I don't know how I didn't die there. Then we're gonna pop, <laughs> okay. We're gonna pop over this, hop. <laughs> all right, now through the stop sticks, this one's pretty easy. Well, I think it'll be easy. If I hit the hydraulics, I do get a little bit of extra distance, I'll say. Now this one, you don't need the stop, or the, the, the speed up sticks, but I feel like it can't hurt. Now this one, I really need like both of them. If I can get both, uh, if I can get both of the boosts, that would help. Even one, how about one? Okay, there's one boost and no, we're not even close. I needed to try this just, they're like, I, I feel like, yeah, even on my best run, I can't get over that. Okay, I have an idea. If I only use one, there's less weight in the truck, and you get extra height. Whoa, that is about as cool. Oh my God, are those swinging mazes? What is this? I'm not gonna lie, Alex. This looks very, this looks very unhealthy. Ow, wow, those do not move at all. Uh, Okay, so I can't let that touch my truck at all. All right, banana mobile. Okay. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Not today, Satan. You'll notice that the paint job on this truck is getting lighter as time goes on. That's because what's happening is uh, my soul is slowly leaving this truck. Oh, I can't even tell where these things are. Ah, I'm still here. Never mind. I want this truck to be able to do it. It can get this far. Oh, okay, just, what is it? This one's like really slow. Where, where's the, where is it? Okay, so there's, oh, they are. They're on completely different times. No, just go, Gray, just go, just go. It'll be fine. Don't think about it. Don't think about it. Oh, 800 times the, ch oh, I got past it. Well, I got past one of them. I feel so good about just that little bit of success, and then I realize there's like eight more of these things to do. <laughs> I want to die. I'm serious. This is awful. This is the most painful segment in GTA I've ever had to do. Yes! Yes! Oh, yeah, baby! Finally! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, uh, there's teleporting, whoa! There's teleporting ramps with teleporters everywhere. So that's, oh, it's like teleports. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna go. We're, no, 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 no. Where am I? Where am I? Where is this? I thought it would just teleport me back to the beginning of the board, but I, like, where is, where is this truck? Is this just over the board? Where am I? Uh, where's the Pinto at? All right, I got good news and I got bad news. God. Uh, no! What is that ahead of this? The good news is if you do hit the teleporter, you can get back on the course. Oh. Uh, the bad news is the Pinto can't. So, oh no. So when you get teleported, the Pinto gets teleported somewhere else. I'm close. I'm so close. You, you have to do this kind of really slow, like there. Yes. Yes. What is this? What sort of Miami Turnpike spaghetti is this? What are you even supposed to do? Oh no. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm doing it. I'm doing it. This is actually happening right now. If you hug the wall, you can kind of make this work. It looks a lot worse than it really is. That was my second try, and I got it. So, oh, whoa, whoa. All right, so the floor breaks out here. Okay, oh, the floor is starting to get wider. Oh my God, what have you done, Alex? Oh, okay, all right. Oh, oh, I, I think I could do this. I think I could do this. Now, it is launching Pintos at light speed, except for that one, that one's all broken. <laughs> okay, but the rest of these are kind of working. So I just, oh, whoa. I just need to make sure. <laughs> that I don't get hit because man, they pack a punch. Oh, and there's, what is this? There's little, uh, there's little uh, ray guns as, oh no, oh my God, no, oh, no. Why are there so many down here? What is this? We can do it, we can do this, we can do this, we can't do this. I know this is the truck that can do this. It has to be. Uh, Oh, okay, that one broke down. That's good. So now I just have to deal with this, and then, oh! Oh my God, there's a boost there! Ah! Ah, just go, great! Just go! Don't stop! Just don't stop! Oh my God! Ah! Oh! Oh my God! Ah! What is this? What is this? What's with the gap? Do you have to, uh, like, ride this sideways? Oh! Hold on, I know. So in order to get the Pinto out of the truck, here, watch. Flip the truck, the Pinto bloops out, and this is what Alex meant where he said, you need a Pinto in order to complete the board. Hope, I hope to God this thing fits through the middle of this pain. And come on, baby, let me have this. Yes! Oh, and that means that we have a winner! <laughs> yes! Oh! Well, I transported cars, and PD and Alex transported about 50 years off my life. Hey, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of GTA. Until next time, stay foxy and much love.